Welcome back to another video. New York State Audit here, and we're at the Niskayuna Town Hall, located in Niskayuna, New York. I believe there's a police station as well uh, in the same building. So we'll go in and check it out. We're here to peacefully exercise our First Amendment right to record in public in publicly accessible areas. So let's walk around for a little bit, take some video of the outside before we make our way in. Niskayuna honors all veterans. We're gonna come over here and check this out, this memorial. Get a little closer. And you can see they have names. I don't even want to walk on it, to be honest. You know, I feel like I'm disrespecting them by stepping on their names but i didn't choose to to put them on the floor so i mean no disrespect at all <clears throat> we'll check that out also i believe they have uh weddings here so let's take a look at it then we'll check the side of the building But yeah, I walked over here and very beautiful area. Niskayuna is a very beautiful town. The people I walked by say good morning. It was just very nice. All right, so this is how this looks. There's really not that much. I'll show you the surrounding area. And I believe over there is a library. But don't quote me because I'm not sure. So we're going to check the side of the building out first to see if maybe the police station entrance is located on the other side of this building. And while we're here, uh, we're going to go and fill out some FOIA requests. So I definitely want to fill out a few FOIA requests. Let's get a little information. I also want to see who I need to speak to so we can give, uh, well, so I can give some compliments to three officers. So we see if we can get that information while we're here. So as you could tell, We'll take a quick look at the parking lot. Twenty-four hour video surveillance. Looks like we have some ooh, almost busted my butt there. Looks like we have some solar panel energy sources here. Nice. All right, so let's check out what this sign says real quick. It's not much of a parking lot. So parking for town business only. Let's see if we can get that to clear up. Doesn't look like it. Parking for town business only, all others told at vehicle owner's expense by order of the town board. All 
right, so it doesn't seem to be much. And there is a police section right there. So, got a couple town of Niskayuna water and sewer department. Pretty cool. See what they got inside. Not much. Not much at all. So it looks like the police entrance is in the back. But I think I saw a vehicle with a logo on it. Just want to check it out. Town of Niskayuna, New York. 1809. Pretty cool. Wonder what that person does. So I think I want to go into the town hall first. So we can check that out before we go here. But let's check this out. See what they got over here first. Safe exchange zone. Okay. Got some signs here about the EV charging stations. So if you wanna, if you got an electric vehicle, this is the section you can park in. Town of Niskayuna, Schenectady Company, New York. Just a regular car from what it looks like. Official vehicles only. I want to get out the heat, to be honest. See if they got some AC. All right, so there is the police department entrance, I believe. But we'll, like I said, we'll make our way to the town hall first. So, yep, here's the sign. They got a town court here as well. Definitely a beautiful area. All right, let's go inside. See if we're treated with respect. Okay, let's see what kind of signs they have here. So nine to five, Monday through Friday. Looks like they got a summer concert. I don't know if you can see it because of the glare. Public notices, updated COVID-19 protocols. It just lets you know that the, the mandate has been lifted. So we don't need to wear a mask. Uh, looks like the town clerk's name is Michelle Martinelli. Hopefully I pronounced that right. Martinelli, Martinelli. <laughs> that sounds silly just trying to pronounce it. All right, so let's go inside. We'll, hopefully we can meet Miss uh, Martinelli. Oh, sorry for the darkness. The light changed there. Changed everything. All right, so I don't see any signs. Let me take off my hat. Oh, this looks nice.
Good morning. Um, may I have a, a FOIL uh, request form? Sure. Thank you. Two of them is possible, please. Thank you. Thank you. May I borrow a pen? I don't, I'm, I'm sorry to be a pest. <laughs> Thank you so much. Right. Thank you for helping me. My name is Daniel, and you are? Michelle. Michelle. Oh, cookie, you're the town clerk. Oh, perfect. Okay, thank you so much. Right. May I stand here and uh, fill this out, or should sure. I just... How about over there, just in case we get more people coming? Yeah, of course, of course. Thank you so much.
Alrighty, Miss Michelle. I'm not even gonna take a chance and pronounce your last names. <laughs> uh, there's your pen. Uh, um, I do. Um, it's it's all through the email and stuff like that. I just wanted to give my my first name and, and my email address and stuff like that. Okay. Um, very good. I have a question. Is this where I would be to uh, file for compliments for like an like an officer, or do I go to the police station next door for like if I wanted to give an officer a compliment? Oh. So you can actually go around to the police, the police station. Okay, all right. Yeah, I, I did a little a walk through real quick, just to, you know, because I've never been here before. So okay. I figured I'd just ask to save me a trip, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> all right, thanks, Miss Michelle. You have a great day. So go here. So on the second floor administration. Before we go to the police station, we will take a look. Very beautiful building. All right. Okay. All right, so we have some pictures here. Looks like there's some some people busy. We got an elevator. Police administration. I wonder if we have to go in there for anything. She said we have to go to next door. So we'll check that out first. So this is where you will go to to speak to the town attorney, along with information technology and engineering. You can see a little small office. Nice picture. So this is the floor we're on. building department here where they make all the good things happen so we'll head downstairs now and you can see right here all right so we'll head out
so we didn't get to look much, but this is the front desk. Very nice building. I like it. Beautiful. All right, so let's head around the corner. Well, got to give the tall, the tall, excuse me, the town hall. We got to give them props there. She helped me. She didn't even flinch. And she clearly saw that I was filming her. So that's the town clerk. Miss Michelle. Definitely professional and courteous. So we're going to go into the police department. Let's see. Uh. Hopefully it's the same way, but we're going to go here and uh, see how their layout is, as well as see if we can give some compliments. All right. Oh, somebody smelled very nice. You see, we can't get in yet. They have to allow us in. They got a key card locking system. Hello, I'm, I'm hoping you can. Um, I would, is this where I go to get uh, information regards to like an incident number that I have here? I'm your spoiled, so you go to the town court. Does it involve you? Um, it, involve, it involves them going to a post office. So technically there's no actual name. Are you on that? Yeah, I'm, I, I was there, yes. I, I'm the person. You're on the answer? Okay, let me see that. Yep. I, I also have another question. Um, is this where I go to file uh, compliments? Compliments? Compliments. You know how people like to complain all the time about officers? Oh, no, no, no. No, I don't want to make a complaint. I want to file a compliment. Um, uh, in regards to who? Um, a, a couple officers uh, that I have down there, I believe. No, actually, it's not even on there. Yep, they are there. Okay. Right, um, yeah, so. Do you want to talk to him? Um, to the sergeant? Today. The sergeant is, right? Yes. I don't know if that would help. I just, what I would need is any kind of like email or kind of like paperwork that you guys give out to the public. So if they want to compliment an officer or sergeant. Okay, you uh, know, let me check with the secretary. Okay, yeah, may I ask him? My name is Daniel. Am I asking him speaking to? What's that? My name is Daniel, by the way. I'm John. John, nice to meet you, John. Nice to meet you. Um, let me check this. This is probably a CAD call. Do you remember what date is, is this? The, yep, that's that's the date right there. Yeah, I try to I try to give you as much information as I could there. I try to give you as much information okay. as I could there. Look that up. Yep. All right, so we're just gonna wait a little bit. Hopefully, uh, Mr. John can help us out.
Hey, how's it going? Nice seeing you again. Did you ever give the officers your name at that incident? There's a post office incident, but it just got... Good citizen? Yeah, stranger. G good good citizen, yeah, that's the name I gave. Okay. So what I can do is I can give you the... This is a CAD call, so this is something I dispatch, uh, the countywide uh, assigns to it. Okay. I can give you the incident report number, and then you have to go to the county clerk's office okay, all right. and foil through that. So all right, yeah, no problem. And then the secretary said as far as a compliment, if you go on the website, miscommunitypound.org, yep. Um, you go to the, the police department and you can email the chief of compliment. Okay. All right. The chief of police. Uh, how you pronounce? How do you pronounce their last name? Cochan or Cochin? Cochan. Correct. Cochan. Cochan. Yeah. Okay. All right. Thank you. Hey, hey, hey. Did you, how's your head? <laughs> it's better. Right, nice you to see you again, Sarge. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm doing a lot better, to be honest. Well, uh, at least you could see my face last, yeah, this last time. time you were yeah, last time I was covered. I still have the mask on me, just yeah. in case. Um, did, yeah. you, did you ever follow up with the post office? Yes, yeah. How did that go? They have a sign up now. There is a no trespassing sign. I still have that. They really do have a sign? They do. Okay, with, like, for the parking area. The, yeah, the back employee okay. parking area. All There's, right. It so says they put U.S. One property, out. and it, it's got, like, it, it, it's red, white, and blue. Okay. But it has, like, the official vehicle side, and then it says, right next, like, on the wall next to it, it says no trespassing. Okay. Oh, I'm but I saw it, and I was like, I wonder if they actually talked to you, because I told you to follow up with them and sit and, down. And, yeah, and I did. How and I did. Uh, I, I didn't get to sit down with them. Uh, I went in person. Yep. Um, I spoke to... DeMarco, I believe, is one of okay. the managers there. Okay. Uh, nice gentleman. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I, you know, I just we had a discussion about that. Plus, we had a discussion about another matter. Yeah. Uh, that I was trying to bring to their attention, yep. but you know, with no results, unfortunately. But uh, yeah, the uh, I don't think the uh, the guy postmaster's name is Steve. Okay. And I went there trying to speak to him. And I want to say I saw him in the background, but he didn't come out. He wouldn't come out. Yeah, he, the, the, it's it's all good though. You yeah. know, the manager came out. I just thought it was funny. Yeah. Uh, cause right when I left after I finished, cause I'm doing the same thing I'm doing now. No, right I when I left, I, I, he gave me a call. Right when I left the building. Oh, the postmaster. Yeah, Steve. So oh, I, you know, so naturally I was laughing inside. Yeah, you know, yeah. I'm like, but I spoke to him. You know, he assured me that uh, future visits are going to be fine, and you know, yeah. and stuff like that. You know, which was which is you know all I really I didn't want to complain or anything no, like no, you no. know like that. So. So, well, uh, so what did I tell you? I said, speak to the person and try to, because a lot of the employees, like, you know, you come in, you know, how the incident went, and it's, right. you know, people are like, he's filming us. They, they might not know that they can be filmed. Right, or, right. And if it's education to try to make, you know, awareness for all of them. Right, it's, 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 especially if we're doing it with respect yeah. and stuff like that, yeah. which I hope I hope I did. No, you were day. fine with us. We didn't have an issue with you. No, I mean with them because they made me feel like, yeah. <laughs> like I was well, doing wrong you well, know, you, when I wasn't. And you're, so, you're an so. auditor. You're, and there are some First Amendment auditors that are very, you know, they try to get in people's faces. And, right. You know, and you know, everybody's different. Yeah. And, and, and that's not, I, you know, I don't, you know, that's not how I go about things. No. You know, I, I don't, people, I don't, I feel like people are not going to want to listen, you know, to someone who's. Yeah. Well, there's a difference between out. someone that's trying to generate, you know, clicks on a website or clicks on their, their YouTube channel or Instagram, right. as opposed to someone that's like, hey, I'm trying to... To bring some type of change. People. Yeah. Right, right. And, that, and that's what I'm hoping I can do, because yeah. I, I can care less, you know, about the likes and about the subscriptions yeah. and yeah. stuff like that. Oh, the only thing I care about really is is exposing the good, the bad, and the ugly. Yeah. <laughs> you know, that because there's a lot of, you know, people who are always... 
complaining about cops and stuff like yeah. that, you know, because of their experiences. But I, I, I'm here to actually give compliments, oh. you know. So I was trying to find out exactly what kind of information I needed, which Mr. John told me. He told me I need to go. I need to go to the niskiuna.org, I believe it says. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, that's the town website. Yep, yep. The town website, and uh, I guess I got to reach out to the. Chief of Police? Yeah, you Conach? can do, there's a, uh, Cochin, Chief Cochin, of Police. Yeah, there's excuse a, me, a, a section. I have it right here, yep. you, yeah, you go on the police section of the, the town website, and there's a whole thing, there's a section where you can just, you can email the chief directly. Okay. Or, you know, All right, yeah, yeah. So, well, I kind of went into it because I, I wanted to see if the if it would actually give me his information, but <laughs> instead it just wants you to give your information. Well, That yeah. way they can reach out to you. So, and yeah, what they do is it emails, it does go directly to the chief. Right, because right. Because mainly... We have people, um, if they have traffic complaints, parking okay. complaints, all, you know, any of that kind of stuff, suspicious vehicles, they yep. put it in, and it's good to have a reference to be able to, you know, to contact them back and find get more detailed information. Right. Yeah, I, I didn't um, mind, you know, and I, I just figured, I didn't want to go through the website, I want, you know, I, I kind of like to do things in person, yeah. so I figured I'd just come here, I just, I just actually came from the town hall. Uh, I spoke to the town clerk, Miss Michelle. I'm not going to pronounce her last name. I'm not going to try. Martinelli? Yeah, yeah. Mar Martinelli, right? Okay, yeah, yeah. Very nice lady. Okay, great. Uh, yeah, I just did a foil over there. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to go back because he's telling me that I might need to go back over there. But I'm thinking, hey, I don't, I don't want to spend too much time here, to be honest. Oh, and, I, you know, and it's, and it's kind of hot outside. I got to yeah, walk. You know, I got a little walk out there. <laughs> yeah, How far so. are you walking, if you don't mind me asking? Uh, I mean, like where are you based out of? I cut through. I cut through Central Park and stuff like that to get okay. to like Al Albany Street so and State Street. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So it's it's not it's nothing. You it's, know, I'm in shape. No, it's not that bad. I'm in shape. I got yeah, this. Got, got I got the sombrero. On my back. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I got to do. Hey, I just take my time. You know, okay. and, and plus, you know, the people. This kid is very nice. Well, I to be honest, it. I I've, I've you know they look at me and I'm walking around with my shirt off yeah. and stuff and they're like good morning that, and stuff. Was that you walking up this probably I don't know half an hour ago? Yeah, you I were believe that was. Ball were you parked right there by a uh, ball no, town? No, that was, that was a, I was okay. there for a second. Yeah, because I looked over and I was like, no, that's not him. No, I drove <laughs> I drove by you, but I saw you walking north. You were walking towards. Yeah, that was me. Yeah, okay. That was most likely me. Like sunglasses and the sombrero. <laughs> yeah, I saw a kid with a sombrero, no shirt on. Yeah, that so was me. That, yeah, yeah. It's not a sombrero, but well, I. Well, you were calling it. We'll call it that. But yeah, that was me. That was me. All right, so. All right, well, you got your information? You yes. Need. I yep, just want to touch base with you because... No, I appreciate I you coming out. No, no, I, I... Hey, you saw me and you came out and I appreciate that. You know, I, I didn't think you would really recognize me because I did have the mask on. Like, yeah. Uh, all you need to do is look down. You'd be like, yep, that's him. Yeah, the one who got his ankles broken. Yeah. <laughs> no. Well, do you think you're going to be ready to play basketball before the end of the summer? Hopefully. I don't know. I think I'm going to have to go to uh, go back to my wiffle ball. You know, that's, I think I'm going to have to do some Wait, wiffle ball. Wiffle yeah, because, you know, I got kids that I'd be doing. Because I try to find different sports to get, like, adults active yeah. and stuff. Because, you know, as we get older, they don't want to do things that much. So yeah. I figured, hey, wiffle ball, you really can't make excuses with that. You don't have to move too much. Yeah. <laughs> you know, but, you know, it's... But anyway, I'm not going to take too much of your, of your time and stuff. Did John give you the Chiefs? Uh, extension? Um, this is what he actually gave okay. me. He gave me just the first paper. You can grab that if you want. This one is actually the information I brought. But he gave me, because I only had the CAD number. Yeah, that's gave, the, the incident report Yep, number. he gave me the incident number, so I might I might just make another visit, honestly, because you guys were just very nice. And, you know, I think the world... Give me one second. I'll yeah, no on. problem. I'm, I'm going to no, know. Like I said, you got important things to do. <laughs> okay. It was good to see you. <laughs> yeah, again. likewise. Okay. And uh, hopefully when I see you again next time, it'll be, you know, in the same circumstances. Yeah, Positive. Absolutely. And, and my name back. is Daniel. Okay, Daniel. Yeah, you Very know, good. so you know, I told you I would I would give you, you my name, but hey, it's not during drinks. I agree. <laughs> like I said. Yeah, I don't drink that movie. No, 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 of course not. <laughs> I'm off duty, of course. Nah, but yeah, thank you for your time and right. uh and I'll see you guys soon. All right, yeah, definitely talk to you again. Likewise. All right, take, take care, stay safe. You too. Why is this door so low? Why is this so low? Is it for little kids? You only got oh, little kids. Yeah, if this building was built in the nineties, it was probably yeah. designed. So. <laughs> oh man, take it easy. Right, take oh man, it's the door is low. You got to be very short or you got to be walking on your knees. All right. So we just finished. Uh, we got the information. I'll show you guys here. I don't know if you can see it, but niskiuna.org. Uh, they gave me a report number for the the United States Post Office in Niskiuna. So it's the chief. So when I get to my house, I'll send him a message or an email. I want to give 
uh, a few officers compliments and that sergeant right there uh, I think he pronounces his name Freya I believe it is but don't hold it against me because I'm I can't remember but he was the sergeant who responded to the post office uh, because the post office instead of calling the postal police they called the Niskiuna police department but uh they didn't get the results they wanted and I'm you know I was just disappointed that they actually called for no reason I tried to get them to de-escalate the situation but you know that's that's a different different topic but when it comes to the Niskiuna town hall and the Niskiuna police station definitely hands down they passed you know i went in there no one bothered me uh when i was in the town hall i believe the lady on the in the middle the secretary i'm not even sure what she was saying so i if i say anything i'll just be speculating to be honest because i, I really couldn't hear any conversation uh that was about me or anything like that so you know, if I did say anything, I'd just be making stuff up, really, and I don't do that. But it was definitely a great experience. Niskiuna is definitely a beautiful town. And the people in the town hall and the police station are just as beautiful, in my opinion. But, yeah, that's going to be it for the video. If you guys like the video, smash that like button. Hit the share button. That way we can expose the good, the bad, and the ugly. And this is definitely going to be exposing the good here. And all the information that I'm going to have for you, I'm going to walk across the street. I always put all the information in the description. That way you can always make calls if you guys need to make calls to, for compliments. You know, you, if you guys need to make complaints, the, the information is in the description as well. You know, the more people that see the video and like it and share it, that's awesome. But in reality, we need to actually make calls. And we, you know, that's the only way we can actually hold people accountable. You know, whether it's the bad that they do or whether it's the good that they do. You know, we can only do so much when it comes to uh, liking the video and sharing the video. But we can actually make change. If we just actually call these people when when they deserve compliments, we call and we give them compliments. If if they need to be held accountable because of the way they mistreated us, then we need to call the mayor. We need to call whoever needs to be called. The, the information will be in the description always. But um, I'm going to wrap it up. Thank you guys for watching. You guys take care of each other and you guys stay safe.